she's hotel royalty, he's banking aristocracy. Together, Nikki Hilton and James Rothschild are the ultimate power pair. Get ready to peek inside the palatial properties of this powerful couple as we go on a house tour adventure like no other. Along the way, we'll look back on Nikki and James' romantic love story as well as their grand wedding. First stop on this glitzy house tour is Nikki and James' incredible New York City penthouse. Tucked away in Manhattan's trendy NoHo neighborhood, this posh pad spanning over 5,000 square feet provides the perfect East Coast home base for the family. Hotel heiress Nikki lent her feminine flair to the design, but husband James took the lead transforming this lavish apartment into a masterpiece. He incorporated ornate antique furnishings like an heirloom marble mantle and custom hand-painted wallpaper inherited from his aristocratic English ancestors. The result here is a vibe blends old world charm and modern glamour. According to Nikki, James did the vast majority, but I added my little feminine touches my little accessories. At the heart of this abode is the open concept living and dining space where the family spends quality time together. The sprawling eating kitchen overlooking the living room provides the ultimate hangout. As Nikki says, my favorite room is the kitchen and it's where the whole family hangs out. While this posh penthouse is full of precious antiques, Nikki prioritized comfort over stuffy formality. She explained, I grew up in a house where certain rooms were off limits. I wanted a home where no room is off limits. Well, Nikki took charge designing one special space herself, the nursery for their daughters, Lily Grace and Teddy Marilyn. She transformed this room into a princess paradise with a custom ballerina mural, floral fabrics, and a pink color scheme. Nikki said, I had so much fun doing this room. You just get to relive your childhood again. From lavish yet livable spaces to playful pops of color, this New York penthouse perfectly blends Nikki and James styles into a family-friendly dream home. When it's time to escape the big city, this power pair heads to their stunning Hamptons house. Purchased in 2018 for $2.75 million, this charming six-bedroom Brookhaven cottage provides the ultimate weekend retreat. Set on four acres of lush land, the 1920s Brick Manor house features a sprawling backyard with in-ground pool hidden from prying eyes. Inside, many rooms flaunt Nikki's preferred floral fabrics by British brand Benison, along with custom upholstery. A bright and airy bedroom reveals that the couple was still settling into this exact Hamptons haven, captured unpacking and making themselves at home. This countryside cottage emanates cozy and casual vibes, perfect for relaxing away from the hustle of the big city. From their posh New York penthouse to this peaceful Hamptons hideaway, Nikki Nikki Hilton and James Rothschild transition seamlessly from city living to coastal cool. Now that we've toured some of this power pair's most prized properties, let's take a look back at Nikki and James's romantic love story. It all began back in 2011 when the two first crossed paths at a lavish Italian wedding. They immediately felt a spark, but they maintained a long distance relationship with Nikki in LA and James in London. Nikki recalls once we decided we really wanted to make this work, we both moved to New York. In 2014, James got down on one knee and proposed during a romantic boat ride on Italy's picturesque Lake Como. Soon, this couple was jet setting back to Europe for the ultimate fairy tale wedding. On July 10, 2015, Nikki Hilton and James Rothschild exchanged vows at the beautiful Kensington Palace in London, where the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge reside. Nikki glowed in a $77,000 Valentino gown fit for a princess. Their intimate affair for 300 guests was held in the palace's idyllic orangery. Nikki says that their regal venue was perfection. I've always wanted a destination wedding and I love London. Ever since their storybook nuptials, Nikki and James have been living their happily ever after, while expanding both their family and their real estate portfolio at the same time. From lavish weddings to stunning stateside homes, Nikki Hilton and James Rothschild continue to live life to the fullest together. While their regal residences might seem over the top, at the core, these two are focused on family. Their priority will always be raising their daughters in comfortable yet glamorous homes. 
As Nikki says, while I love visiting LA, New York has my heart. I think it's the most electric, fun, and exciting city in the world. The couple found their perfect match in each other and the ideal home in their palatial New York penthouse. While that wraps up today's house tour, thanks for joining me on this grand look at the properties owned by one of the world's most influential power pairs. And before we go, answer this question for me. Given the option, would you prefer to spend more time in the heart of Manhattan or retreating away in the stunning Hamptons? Let me know where you would spend the majority of your days if you had the choice in the comments below. Don't forget to hit subscribe and turn on your notifications so you never miss a video. I'm Kara the Vampire Slayer, follow me on Instagram to chat and if you'd like to take a look at more stunning celebrity homes then stay tuned for this look into the houses of Nikki's sister, the one and only Paris Hilton. Bye! Paris Hilton and her husband Carter Reem started the year 2023 in the right way and as a surprise to all. The heiress and woman of many hats is now also a mom for the first time, announcing that she and Carter welcomed a newborn son via Instagram. Paris likely already set up a dreamy nursery at her Los Angeles mansion for her baby boy and it's definitely going to be impressive to match the rest of the place. She purchased her longtime mansion in the guard-gated Mulholland Estates area Area back in 2007. And in recent years, Paris has given the property a full facelift, showing off the renovations on YouTube. We've also seen her multi million dollar crib on her reality show, Paris in Love, which offers 7,000 square feet of space and amazing highlights like a dream dressing room and even a doggy mansion. In these videos, we don't reveal any addresses, and even though I've done a house tour of my own place, please do not show up at any private residences because it's not safe for anyone. Paris Hilton maintains her longtime mansion located in Beverly Hills. Back in 2007, she purchased this stunning mansion in the celeb-favored, guard-gated community of Mulholland Estates for $5.9 million. We've gotten plenty of glimpses of the estate not only on Paris's Instagram and YouTube, but also on her reality series Paris in Love. The Mediterranean-style mansion was built back in 1991 and spans about 7,000 square feet of space with five beds and 5.5 baths. Meanwhile, the grounds surrounding the home span about an acre. There is a gorgeous two-story entryway with a winding staircase where Paris often poses for photos. Other features of her mansion include living rooms, a large family room with wet bar, office, gourmet kitchen and breakfast room, butler's pantry, wine closet and more. It also came complete with a full gym, but word was that Paris transformed that into a shoe closet instead. Now, with baby number one's arrival, I'm sure that Paris and Carter have set up a stunning nursery for their son. They just haven't shown it off yet. Considering how luxurious Paris is, many adorable dogs are living like, we can only imagine how stylish the new baby's room is gonna be. Paris also has a custom screening room, which she claimed is one of her favorite spots in the house. Another cool bonus lies in this room of the home, which she explains, I built one of those hidden escape doors that looks like like a bookshelf. It leads to a huge showroom for all my product. It's kind of like a secret office. Oh my god, there's such a coolest door right here. You know in movies when they have like a fake kind of like library? Well, this room is decorated in a French Victorian vibe like much of the rest of the home was. And there's a 120 inch screen, photo booth, pink pool table and more. Meanwhile, up a small flight of stairs in here, there's also Club Paris, her very own nightclub upstairs with everything from smoke machines to a dancing pole to a DJ booth. Because Paris is also a DJ, as you probably know. In 2020, Paris revealed her major home renovation that was was going on and we could see that she stripped all of the interiors down to make way for a brand new look. She gutted the whole mansion and she decided to switch things up completely. Paris even has a glam room where she can easily get ready for events or a night out with Carter. Elsewhere in the mansion, Paris's master suite has a glamorous bath attached as well as a private balcony with city views and the star modified the home to fit two decked out closets the size 
of an apartment or bigger, not to mention a dressing room attached to the master bath as well. Moving to the grounds of Paris's main residence, there's a sparkling pool and spa with an attached grotto along with her famed doggy mansion. This is a feature I actually need in my life, but I don't have as many dogs as her. I need it for my two dogs. In 2009, Paris purchased this soggy mansion and paid $325,000 for it. But we all know that she loves dogs just like me and always has a handful of pets living with her. The upscale dog house for her Hilton pet boasts 300 square feet of living space with built-in air conditioning controlled from the outside to protect the dogs from the LA heat. There's also heating, of course, for when it cools down. Her dog's mansion is Spanish colonial style with two levels, and the second floor has a balcony where the pups can catch a beautiful view. Inside there are bright pink walls, a black wrought iron lined railings, and even a chandelier. Day beds, bean bags, and dog beds are all around the house for the pups to relax on. Outside there's a cute fenced in turf lawn while the large front door welcomes the pups with a golden fire hydrant. That isn't the only house Paris owns though. In August 2021, it was reported that everyone's favorite hotel heiress turned a girl turned businesswoman snagged a beachfront home for $8.4 million, which is perfect for when she, Carter, and now their new baby wanna escape Beverly Hills for a more laid back vibe. Located on Lacoste the Beach, Paris's new getaway in Malibu is a prime spot and right on the water. Records show the Malibu house was built back in 1955 but it seems to have underwent a huge renovation sometime in the 90s. While it's contemporary in style, the interiors also kind of have a vintage feel with salmon colored tiles and rounded granite counters in the kitchen, just to name a few details. Paris's Malibu love nest spans 2,968 square feet of space with three beds and three baths throughout. In fact, Miss Hilton already teased a promo video for her series Cooking with Paris in this very kitchen. And I mean, if she doesn't feel like cooking, she's only a short five minute drive from the longtime trendy restaurant Nobu Malibu. While Paris and Carter's crib is right on top of the Pacific Coast Highway, the modern home is nicely hidden behind a dark blue wall along with cameras and a security system. Before walking in, there's also a simply landscape courtyard and the exterior is a solid white color while inside tile floors grace the open concept living area and dining room. As you may expect from a beachfront home, there are full walls of glass everywhere. Take in the stunning ocean views. Aside from the walls of windows, the open living room boasts a fireplace to warm things up when it gets chilly. And there's also a flat screen TV as well as a bar to one side. On the opposite wall, you'll find the dining area. The main living space also has a spacious concrete deck outside with room for an outdoor eating area or just to relax. Paris is probably already cooking up a storm in this slightly vintage 90s meets early 2000s aesthetic kitchen. Here there are rounded granite countertops with a ton of meal prep space as well as top of the line stainless steel appliances. This staircase is built with salmon colored tiles which I think matches the vintage beach house vibe perfectly. And upstairs is where you'll find the home's three bedrooms. Paris and Carter's Ocean View Master Retreat offers hardwood flooring, its own private balcony as well as a cozy fireplace and mounted TV above. The luxury attached bath might be slightly dated, but it's surely still stylish. There's some retro colored marble, a built-in soaking tub, glass shower, as well as double vanities. Outside the home, stairs from the patio lead to La Costa Beach, and on Paris's property, some other add-ons include an outdoor shower, jacuzzi, and a two-car garage. Now that we've checked out Paris Hilton's homes in Beverly Hills and Malibu, I think we'll bring today's house tour to a close. But before you go, answer me this. If money and resources Sources weren't an issue. Would you prefer to go the surrogate route like Paris when having a baby and like so many other celebrities do? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below or what you liked about Paris's homes. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on your notifications. My name is Kara the Vampire Slayer. Follow me on Instagram to chat and I'll see you all in another video. Bye!